Hello, my very most beautiful Geminis. How is everyone? I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So, my lovelies, we are going to be doing your April weekly reading. Now, this is a general reading, and it may not be able to resonate for all of you. So, if you want something that is meant for your exact energy, then I do have personals open. And everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or about scheduling your personals, all of that will be in the description box below for you. So, Archangels, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors, please deliver clear messages with a very clear understanding Ooh, for my very most beautiful Geminis. Please, may the messages that need to be heard the very most please come through, and may they please find those who need to hear it. Please show me Gemini's energy, a very clear message with a very clear understanding. All right, my lovelies, let's take a look and see what we've got going on for you. Something unexpected. Six of Pentacles in the reverse at the bottom of the deck. For your general overall energy i don't know how much you're willing to give to a situation there's definitely something very unexpected um some something to do with communication we're gonna i'm gonna want to clarify this um because i don't know if it's communication coming in that um kind of shakes everything up for you like something like some information that you find out um or if it's somebody just reaching out to you we're gonna need to take a look i kind of do feel like there's something that has been yeah it kind of feels to me there's something here that is coming to the light something that has been maybe kept from you um, that is causing a great deal of pain here Gemini okay um, and it's causing you to no longer want to give to a situation that's kind of what it feels like to me I feel like you're finding something out there's some information coming into you that causes the tower moment okay it just is you know just very sudden very abrupt very abrupt tell me about this knight of swords energy what is this Knight of Swords energy about? Why is that Knight of Swords energy here? Tell me why the Knight of Swords is here. The Five of Pentacles. Whatever this is, it's causing you to... Um, yeah, it's causing... I feel like it's causing you to walk away from something. It's causing you to leave somebody behind here. Um, it's definitely it's definitely shaking things up. It's causing a major change. You got two Fives. You have the Five of Pentacles and the Five of Cups here. So whatever this information is that's coming in, whatever you're finding out here, um, now that could be like a message that you see, okay, or a message that, you know, information that just comes into you. Whatever it is, it is causing a major tower moment. It's causing you to want to walk away from somebody. It's causing you to feel very, you know, um, very broken, very hurt. You got the King of Swords and the Page of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like you're not interested in anything but the truth you're not interested in hearing any anybody any excuses anybody's crap you you want the truth and you you're ready to face it head on um i also feel like you're ready to cut out anything um you know anything that you need to here i feel like you could be coming very cold very detached um with a person because of whatever this information is that you're finding out your true intentions you got the two of cups in the reverse and the five of cups so this has caused a major just a major disconnect here for you and i do feel like you are grieving the loss of this connection because um i do feel like this is somebody who's very important to you somebody you have a lot of love for so i do feel like you are grieving this feeling a little bit defeated as well we got the five of swords in the reverse and the two of wands so you know you're making a decision to go in a new direction but you're feeling very defeated um you got three fives here so this is definitely a major change in your life we're going to go ahead and get your person's energy out on the table and see what is going on with them. Show me the person that Gemini is dealing with in this situation. What is their energy towards Gemini? What is their energy towards Gemini? Show me the person that Gemini is dealing with. What is their, what is their energy towards Gemini? Six of Pentacles. So you're the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. So whatever this is, you know, it hurt, this information that's coming clear to you, it hurts. And it's causing you to, like, rip it up from the roots. You're just done. Um, yeah, even right under that, you got the King of Pentacles in the reverse. So choosing to no longer be committed to something you can no longer see in your life. Um, they have the Moon card and the Six of Pentacles.
they did not want you to find this out. Okay, they have the strength card at the bottom of the deck, the Knight of Pentacles. They're trying to figure out, yeah, Queen of Swords in the reverse, Ace of Swords in the reverse. They're trying to figure out what to do here. They are trying to figure out what to do here. Um, the strength card, they're trying to just, you know, I feel like they've been holding a lot back from you. I feel like they're trying to find the courage to deal with it now, um, now that it's all out in the open. They have the Six of Pentacles and the Moon card, so they could have been giving to more than one person, and that could be what is um, being kept from you, okay? Um, that's obviously not going to be for everybody, but it is for somebody out there. It, also, for some of you guys, if this is money-related, if it's not third-party related, um, like where they're not giving their attention to more than one person on a romantic kind of level, you know, this could be financial. You could find out that this person has been stealing from you or has been doing something with your finances, okay, behind your back. So just keep that... Take it how it resonates. Um, we have the Knight of Wands in the reverse and the Devil energy. This, yeah, this person definitely could have like the Playboy, Playgirl type energies uh, attached to them. You know, something very toxic here as well. Um, yeah. With some heavy energy. I feel like you're finding out a lot about this person. And I do. I feel like it just kind of rocks you. Um, you got the Six of Swords in the reverse and the Knight of Swords in the reverse for their true intentions. They did not want you to find this out. Um, they tried to delay you finding this out as long as possible. Um, they did not want you to know. The World card in the reverse and the Queen of Wands in the reverse. So they don't know what action to take. They could be lashing out. They're doing whatever they need. Like, I feel like this could be like a lashing out energy for some of them. Um, like they feel like they're backed into a corner and they didn't want you to find out and they're kind of like lashing out. And it could be very um, toxic. So just be cautious with that energy. For others of you, um, you know, I feel like this is just them feeling like things are very open but not really sure what to do about it. Like they don't want this to be the end but they don't know what to do about it. Like it's too little, too late kind of an energy. Um... We're going to grab another deck and take a look at what your biggest challenge is and then what you don't see coming. Sir, get down. Get down. All right. So show me what Gemini's biggest challenge is. Okay, big itchy, get down. Show me what Gemini's biggest challenge is. What is Gemini's biggest challenge the Nine of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles. So, you know, just moving forward, it's going to take time, um, you know, being on your own, coming up with a plan, figuring out how to be okay on your own, whether that's financially, whether that's, you know, now you got to get a new place or whatever it is, um, is coming up with a plan and moving towards that, figuring out how to, um, you know, how to be okay on your own, how to be good on your own, how to get back to that, you know, um, independent place. And the Knight of Wands, seeing somebody for their player tendencies, um, you know, seeing somebody for, you know, that's just who they are. Now, show me what Gemini doesn't see coming this week. Show me what Gemini doesn't see coming this week. I feel like there's a lot that you don't see coming, Gemini, but let's see what we can get here. The justice card, you know, that you will get justice in the situation. So even though all this is happening and it feels like everything is falling apart and you are definitely getting the short end of the stick here, um, what you don't see coming is that karma is going to have your back on this you are going to get what you deserve out of the situation um and somebody's going to get their karmic justice and you're going to get to see that here okay and that what you don't see coming is that the truth is all coming out okay yeah the devil you're going to see somebody's you're going to see somebody for who they really are um the truth is coming out and you will get justice in this situation okay so and you know the six of swords at the bottom of the deck so you will be okay you're going to move through this Okay, so that is what I'm seeing, guys. These are just weekly energies. These are not permanent outcomes. Um, you know, so just keep that in mind. It's just where the energy lies for about this week. Now, if this resonates, let me know in the comments down below. If it doesn't, check out your other placements. Everything that you guys need to know, whether it's about this reading or about scheduling your personals, all of that will be in the description box below for you. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. And most importantly, guys, if you want personal prayers for any reason at all, just go ahead and put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below, and I will go through and pray for you. So I'm sending so much love and light. Until next time.